Hello, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Hi, good evening. How are you? So fine, teacher. Thank you. you. Pretty good. Thank you. How good. was your weekend? Nice. Yeah? Okay. That's nice. Yes. Good, good. What did you do? I don't know if you remember. I decided to go to the beach. Mm. And so I went there and I have a job there <laughs> too. I installed yeah. some cameras to my uncle's house. Ah. So I spent there for two days. Yes. Mm -hmm. Nice, nice. Mm -hmm. Oh wow. Okay, good. Where, where, where exactly is it? Can you remind me? It's in um Conchagua, next to the El Golfo de Fonseca. Mm -hmm. Nice. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Good. Excellent. Very good. Um. So um, did so. You stayed there for two days? Yes, yes. Oh, yes, wow. I stayed there for two days. We are right there maybe at 10 a.m. on Saturday. And we left um, maybe around 2 p.m. on Sunday. Oh, wow. So we are right here in my house uh, around 6 p.m. on Sunday, too. Oh, nice. Four hours traveling. Wow. Okay. But worth it. Yes. Yes. Absolutely. Oh, I spend good. with family in the beach in the morning, maybe um, 6, 6 a.m. Yes, until the 8 p.m. a.m. And we saw, I don't know how, what is the name of this animal in the beach is Mantarraya. Oh, um, Ray. A Ray. Ray. Mm -hmm. Ray. With D at the end. Ray. Um, hold on. Uh, no. Well, just give me a second. Let me see. I'm going to check out the spelling. Mm. So I was checking in the internet and appears is stingray something mm -hmm. like that stingray um, yes exactly yeah exactly stingray, stingray. Mm -hmm. r r a y okay. we saw it <laughs> mm -hmm. we saw really it. Okay. yes and we start to run out to the beach because uh, la picadura hurts so, so you you got bit bit no 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 Oh, okay. No, we knew it, and when we saw it, a uh, whole red flags appears and go out for, to the beach because the the bite. No, 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 it's not a bite. It's a sting. I don't know. A sting. This yeah. thing it, it, it make you feel a big pain. Yeah, yeah. So um, for that reason, we decide to go to the house. Mm. And left the beach behind because we yeah. couldn't enjoy it anymore. Yeah, well, I, I don't blame you, honestly. <laughs> yes. I, I that's, that's funny. Yeah, I probably would have done the same thing. Yeah, that's 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 pretty yeah, that's pretty scary. All right. Yes. Okay, good. What about the rest of you? I know you probably didn't see a, a stingray, but what about the rest of you? What did you guys do on the weekend? Huh? 
Tell me about it. How was your weekend? Oh, guys, share with me. How was your weekend? Mm-hmm. Cuenten, cuenten. Hello, teacher. Good evening. In my Hi. case, I have a, a party with my son on Saturday. Oh. Oh. Yes, because his friend uh, invited him to uh, his birthday. And we went to the, his birthday. We enjoyed a lot with, with the kids. And that's it. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. Okay. So how, how, many, how many people were at the party? Oh, around fifteen children, and mm -hmm. with her, with their parents. <laughs> oh, okay, fifteen children with the yeah, parents. Yeah, yeah, many people, but uh, it's in in a in a place in McDonald place. <laughs> it was in McDonald. There. Very nice. Okay, so mm -hmm. all right, very good. What about the rest of you? What did you do on the weekend? Mm-hmm. What did you do on the weekend? Nothing? Nothing special? No? Okay. Well, I hope at least you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed your your um your weekend and that you were able to do something a little different than than you know the the, the normal routine schedule. Okay, guys. So what we'll do right now is we'll take attendance. So, one moment. Okay. Um. So we'll start with um Ana Lorena Lobato Orellana. Present teacher. Excellent. Thank you. Carlos Alberto Dominguez Martinez. Carlos Alberto Dominguez Martinez. Carlos Ernesto Hernández Cepeda. Present. Thank you. Carlos Mauricio Menjibar Caballero. Present. Thank you. Edwin Antonio Quintero Sumaña. Edwin Antonio Quintero Sumaña. Emerson Willis Monroy Calix. Present. Thank you. Ulises Torres Torres. Ulises. No. Uh, Eliana Rebeca Carpio Calderón. Eliana. Jorge Antonio Sánchez Quiñones. Jorge Antonio Sánchez. Um, José Bernardo López. Los no lo veo, perdón. José Bernardo López. Present, miss. Okay, there you are. Okay, thank you. José Carlos Argueta Romero. Present, miss. Present. Okay. Are, are you in, on your way home or something? 
Yeah, I am driving to my home. I guess oh, okay. I will be connected on next time, man. Okay. Okay, no problem. Thank you. Thank you for connecting. Um. Okay. Um. Jose Salvador Bernal Quintanilla. I'm here, teacher. Wonderful. Thank you. Postman Otilio Serrano. Present, teacher. Excellent. Thank you. Juan Carlos Herrera Delgado. Present, miss. Excellent. Thank you. Kevin Alfredo Lucero Menendez. Present. Thank you. Mauricio Antonio Velasquez. Present teacher. Thank you. Maire Cecilia Peña de Aparicio. Maire Cecilia Peña de Aparicio. Um, Nelson Alberto Peraz de Mejía. Nelson Alberto. Osman Enrique Hernández. Osman. Rafael Alexander Serna Díaz. Thank you. Ricardo Ernesto Pérez Acosta. Present teacher. Thank you. Uh, Sandra Abigail Bonilla Cano. Present. Thank you. Sigfrido Ernesto Gómez Quinea. Present. Thank you. Wendy Maricela Ramírez Guevara. Wendy Maricela. Evening teacher, present. Okay, wonderful. Eh, Wendy, hágame el favor eh, de cambiar su nombre para que sea su nombre completo. Está bien, teacher. Okay, thank you. Uh, Mirna Elizabeth Alvarenga Garrigas. Present. Thank you. Irma Evelyn Rodríguez Torres. Irma Evelyn Rodríguez Torres. Armando, espero, Armand, espero. Amanda Leonela Zamora Miranda. Amanda. Eduardo Antonio Magaña Monterrosa. Eduardo Antonio. Okay. All right, guys and girls, we are going to start. Do you remember that? Uh -oh. <laughs> I just realized something. Okay, so last class. Okay, then it will be what it will be. Um, okay, so last class we were um, doing this activity. Um, you remember this? You remember this activity? Yeah? Yeah. Okay, good, good. Um, so, um, I told you that today we were going to be presenting because last class we did the activity, but we didn't present it. So I told you that I was, we we're gonna be presenting today. So let's, let's present. Let's do, let's start by doing that. Um, okay, so I just realized that I didn't save the groups. So you guys are gonna have to help me 
with the groups that you were working with. So, um, okay, so let's start with, let's start with Ana Lorena Lovato. Who were you working with, Ana Lorena? Uh, I don't remember very well, but I believe that Jose Carlos Argumedo, if I remember. Yeah, with me, I remember we were working. Okay. okay, so only the two of you, or did you have someone else in your group? No, I only together because the other partners may be uh was a listener because mm. don't, don't participate okay okay perfect so if you guys want we can start with you guys then sorry teacher repeat please uh so we can start with you guys then <laughs> I remember Anna was Anna created any screen. Yes, to work. Yeah, can you share the screen? Yes. Okay. Nice, great. Hmm. I remember Perfect. we have any mistake with the power outage in a food store. And so Ana Lorena is going to explain the, the, the five steps that we that we find in this count in this for man, for managing this problem. Okay, uh, we think in this failure to the food store, um, maybe power outage and um problem with the refrigeration for food. Uh, the thing to a uh, crisis is uh, the people that man maintains a refrigerator, the manager of a store and operator or employees for uh, activities uh, in the store. Uh, the procedure uh, to follow is the operator uh, should identify the crisis because he is who uh, handle the equipment. And next, uh, pues he communicate to the manager uh, and together uh, speak with the maintains department for investigate the problem if it's necessary the this department called to electrical company if the problem is outside the company maybe jose continue okay i remember that in the crisis that we identified uh, the electric the electrical company came to fix the mistake and after that, the manager prepared the report to the incident for the owner, right? And after that, uh, the manager explained the problem and solution to the boss and employees. That's it. Yes, because in this case, the last three steps, uh, the crisis is a uh, into the company for the reason the uh, skip uh, people is the manager uh, for communicate to his boss only that okay all right very Thanks, good Anna. bravo good good job guys good job good job okay all right, um, let's now listen. So, Nelson? Nelson Alberto?
Is Nelson Alberto there? No? Nelson Alberto? Okay. Not there then. Let's start in this one. Okay, what about Carlos Ernesto? Um, I was the listener the last Friday. So you didn't you didn't participate in the discussion? Not the Friday, no. Ah. Okay. Okay, um, Carlos Mauricio. Yes, teacher, sorry. Okay, so who were you working with, Carlos? Um, um Osman. Yes, I think. Osman. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Only with Osman? Um, yes, in my group there was other two guys, but they were listening in that day, so they don't participate. They didn't mm. participate. Okay, so it was only you and Osman that were that were yes. participating. Okay. All right. Osman is not here right now, so we can wait until maybe he connects a little bit later. Okay. 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 Thank you, thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Edwin Antonio. Edwin Antonio. Yes, teacher, I'm here. Okay. Uh, who are you working with? So the Friday I was uh, as a listener. Mm, okay. So you were not, so you weren't participating. Okay. All right, Emerson. Emerson Ulises? Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Well, I was with Bernardo and Wendy, remember? With Wendy and who else? Uh, Bernardo, Jose Bernardo. Ah, Jose Bernardo. Yes. Okay. So I think, okay, so Jose Bernardo and Wendy. Are you ready to present? Last time we were talking about the different mm -hmm. uh, manage, management crisis and we worked uh, and suggest for a different point in the first we said the boss in charge of the area where is occurring the crisis for help the, the personnel. And the second, uh, we do uh, steps about the, the situation. In the second step, we, we we think the notification situation to a personnel in charge of the handle to traces. A schedule dry one month, evaluate the witness and delegate and training the personnel if less provide revise revise stock market dialing. Sorry, what was that one? New about Hello? Can you repeat that one? Previous stock market left daily, provides news about the competitors and tendons of the market. Okay. Okay. 
โอเคที่สองโอเคเอ่อ but what about the rest of your group can Amazon can you share it please <coughs> Sorry, can you repeat that, Jose Fernando? Uh, if Emerson can share the screen oh. again, please. Okay. Thank you, Emerson. Okay. Uh, for example, uh, for the number three, the schedule trail one month for evaluate the weaknesses. Uh, we, we try to make a plan where we can improve uh, our weakness to to get a a short reaction when we when we affront a crisis when we to face. avoid when we face sorry when we face a crisis to avoid the the loot the how how do i say Para perder lo menos posible. Uh, to lose. To avoid, to avoid losing a lot of, of, of resources. Okay. And, and for the last one, the revised talk, and that that means to don't forget the social media because in social media we we can be attacked by some persons or institute or whatever to try to cause damage. So uh, they could um, expand. Oh, uh, um, gossip news. Spread. Spread, spread gossip news. Gossip news. So we we need to to have a short reaction to that kind of fake news. Mm -hmm. That's it. Okay. okay. Very good. Okay. Uh, who who was the other person you group? Did you say? Ah, uh, Wendy, right? Yes, Miss. Wendy, are you there? Wendy? Hmm. I think Wendy may not be there. Okay. All right. Thank you. Uh okay. Hosman? Hello, teacher. Hi. I'm the last and the Friday, uh, I'm the least standard teacher. Sorry, could you repeat, Osman? And the, the last class, uh, I was the least standard in the class, no participating. Mm, okay, you weren't participating. Okay. Okay. Um, Jose Salvador? Teacher, uh, the Friday, I was listener. You're with you're a listener on Friday. Yes. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Um. Kevin. I didn't do the activity teacher on Friday, but um, I want to participate uh, right now. I don't know if I if I can to do if I can do something. Okay. Um. Okay. Were you here on Friday? Yes, but uh, like a listener. Oh, you were listening on Friday. 
Mm. I see. Okay. So were you in the class? Like, did you, did you understand the, the, the activity? Yes. When we are talking about the crisis, Mm -hmm. uh, we need to do a, a process to attack uh, the crisis. Right, yeah. So you had to make a, a crisis communication plan. All right. The, um, the, the steps, right? To, okay. uh, to making a crisis communication plan in your, um, in your job. Like you had to choose a crisis from your job and then you, you create the plan. But uh, the crisis needs uh, uh, after or before the crisis. We need no, to... Before. You have to create the plan um, before. Okay, okay. Pre previous uh, that the Christ uh, attack our company right yeah so you have okay. to you have to create the plan so that you're prepared for it prepared for the crisis okay uh, right now I am I'm going to do the activity and maybe I can participate uh, at the end of other groups sure okay great perfect okay uh let's continue then eulises good evening hi eulises who are you working with on Friday. I don't forget. I don't know because in that moment I believe I had a problem with my internet. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh. Uh I believe it was a listener in that moment. Okay, so you were not participating? No, no. Okay. All right, perfect. And in that case, let's move on with Mauricio Antonio. Yes, teacher. Okay, Mauricio, who are you working with? Uh, it was a listener, but uh, 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 I, I tried the mom. So, sorry, could you repeat that, Mauricio? In the Friday, I was a listener. Oh, okay. So you didn't you didn't do the activity then? Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Mirna. Hello, teachers. I'm Hello. so sorry, but I couldn't connect on 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 Friday. I missed okay. the class, but I talk uh on Tuesday. I think I talk with I not remember exactly with his name but I talk about the management plan but on okay. Tuesday but the communication plan I'm so sorry and apologize but I couldn't connect on Friday I missed the, okay. the, the class sorry okay. no problem thank you thanks for letting me know okay um Rafael Rafael Alexander good evening teacher good evening Rafael who were you working with? Um, sorry, uh, you talking about the Friday class? Mm -hmm. uh, I I can't connect uh, the the Friday. 
Oh, you were not connected on Friday. Yes. Okay. Okay. Thank you, Rafael. Um, Ricardo? Ricardo Ernesto? Ricardo Ernesto? Are you there? No está ahí. Ok. Uh, Sandra, Sandra Abigail. Sandra? Sandra, ¿está ahí? Okay, yeah, she's not there. Uh, Sigfrido? Yes. Okay, were you working with somebody? Eh, yes, but uh, I didn't remember their names, to be honest. Okay. I didn't remember who was my classmate in this activity. I'm sorry. Okay. Does anybody remember working with Sigfrido? Who remembers working with Sigfrido? Nobody remembers working with Sigfrido, really? I think they lost their memory, their memory as well. They have an amnesia uh, during the weekend. Yes, the weekend hit so hard. <laughs> I, I'm not in a bad way. I mean, a lot of words. So. Okay. All right. Do you, okay. Can you, can you do the presentation by yourself, Secreta? Difficult, but I can try. Okay, all I right. Remember something. Perfect. Okay, let's see. Um, I remember we're talking about how to get hack and lost all the information of the company. I mean, like ransomware or some hacker takes the database and stole all the information. Um, basically, the first one was about the communication. So we, we only communicate through email and um, secure lines. I mean, only with the information about the, what is happening is not compromising with the other people or is not compromising with the hacker as well. So in the same way, we also do communicate updates probably every hour or at the end of the day regarding how the crisis, the crisis is going. So in the other hand, we assemble a team. In this case, we probably three people because the company that we're talking about was not a big company. And basically it was the IT manager and backup manager security expert and a legal or consultant expert. Um, in the other hand, to prevent some of these issues was basically about to create at least three backups, backup based on cloud technologies, another backup that could be in another cloud server or in a physical place, and an extra uh, tier backup that will be a physical backup, only just in case the other to back and fails. Um, then I remember the other one was to mock up the situation. So doing some simulations about the the things and try to train in all the persons in charge and probably take care about one of the things not properly training, train it. 
um, just in case for error, drop all the data or drop all the database and the simulation becomes a real crisis. So this is what I remember. So what was the last sentence? Technique. Can you repeat the last sentence? Uh, my memory is too short at this moment, to be honest. The the last thing you said. It was about the recover system information and do a uh, control of simulations of the crisis. Mm -hmm. Like simulacro. Oh, drill. Yeah, it could be a drill. <laughs> and also be sure that one of the people is not properly training. So to avoid errors at the simulation of the crisis becomes a real crisis. I mean, someone by error drops all the information of the database or expose information and one simulation could, could become a big error. So. Okay. Okay, That's very me. good. Very good. Thank you, Sigfrido. All right, thank you. Excellent job. Okay. So I guess then, Kevin, are you ready? Um, really not teacher. I'm going to share my screen and currently I'm working. Uh, can you see my screen? Yes, right now? we can. Okay. Um, in my company, we have, we, we have uh procedure procedure to like pro excuse me procedure procedure mm -hmm. procedure to identify uh, some crisis or some risk uh, for our company uh, all all years we did this activity Mm -hmm. uh, brainstorm the mm -hmm. leaders of each department needs to meet and give ideas of some crisis of the company and in my company we don't speak about crisis we we talk about the the risks risk and mm -hmm. uh, instead of crisis but it's similar really and then we need to define each crisis that we have. And, and then we have to evaluate. And then we have to put the actions to attack the, the crisis. If the crisis um, se materializa, si la crisis se materializa. Uh, develops. If the crisis develop develops yes. uh -huh. develops um, and the crisis can the crisis do, the crisis can do uh, effect negative effects on our company mm -hmm. we need to put in the actions and and finally we need to do the tracking of each action that we define it uh, previously. Uh, I would like to share with, with the class. Um, in my company, we have a software that, and we have identified risk and opportunities for the company mm -hmm. each year. And we have this process that, yes, this process. Uh, define the risk or crisis and crisis. then evaluate crisis and okay. then evaluate and then define the actions and tracking the action that we put it in the past. Yes, is... Um, it is. Yes, yes, it is. Okay, very good. Excellent. Good job, Kevin. Thank you. And thank you for um, 
doing this activity at last minute, like the this uh, last minute's uh, notice, but you uh, did a very good job, you know, and and um, I what's more important is that that willingness to actually learn. So good job. Okay. All right. So if I'm not mistaken, that's everybody, right? Okay, any questions before we continue? No, teacher. Okay. All right, guys, in that case, guys and girls, sorry. <laughs> what we'll do now is we'll start then uh, with our new topic, which is uh, from unit four which is management and motivation. So let me share my screen with you. You see that? Yes, miss. Yes, yeah. teacher. Yes, okay. teacher. Great. Okay, so this is management and motivation. Uh, we'll start, it says, um, how do you motivate employees to engage in value-adding activities that benefit the organization? Do you understand that question? How do you motivate employees to engage in high, sorry, in value-adding activities that benefit the organization? Does that make sense to you, that question? Is that clear or do you have any questions? Uh, I'm not sure about the word engage. It's like a compromiso. Um, yes, but it, not exactly in that term, in those okay. terms. So engage in this case is like um, to participate. Sinergia. Hmm? Sinergia. Sinergia. Uh, mm -hmm. All people know. are working in the same direction, something like that. Uh, Searching the same goals? Not exactly. Just it, it means like to, to be willing to participate um, and be completely dedicated. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Thanks. Mm -hmm. Any other questions that you guys have? Any questions? Okay. All right. In that case, the next question is, do you think employees are more motivated by receiving a higher salary with fewer benefits or a lower salary with more benefits? So which one do you think is employees are more motivated by? So higher salary, fewer benefits, or lower salary, higher benefits. Pretty uh, Is this pretty clear for everybody? Yes. Yeah, we understand? Yes. Yes. Okay, perfect. All right, so what I'll do then is I'll share these questions in the WhatsApp group.
just a minute. Okay, can you see it? You guys see yes, it? Yes, please. Yeah. Okay, perfect. All right, so I'm going to put you guys into breakout rooms so that you can discuss these questions with your group, okay? All right, guys, are you ready? Yes, yes, ready. Yeah, okay, all right. So I'm going to put you guys right now into the breaker rooms. I'll give you five minutes to discuss these questions, okay? Here we go, let's open the rooms. Emerson, Amanda. Hi, teacher. Eh, no puede entrar, Amanda? Uh, no, no, no. I'm, I recently entered. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, and I that, just arrived and I'm from work. Okay, so let me send you right now just to the group. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Since sales school center, I think you have a base salary, like it's a minimum mm -hmm. salary. But yes. if you have an excellent sales, excellent performance, and excellent yeah. things, you get a lot of rewards, like, oh, today's yeah. in of sale, a uh, ticket for, I don't know, to go to Mexico, Dominican Republic, or something like that, a high bonus, a Christmas bonus. You will be able to participate in some giveaway about, I don't know, products a car, probably. I don't know. It depends on the enterprise. It depends on the company. Probably for some companies, it's better to have a low salary, but a great bonus. And another kind of jobs, like, I don't know, IT manager, security manager, they probably has a bigger salary, but they doesn't have any bonus or any extra benefit. It's yes, like, raffles that you say at the at the end of the year. Yeah. You yeah. only will see the Aguinaldo. <laughs> Maybe 14 salaries at the year. Um it is a good dream, but it's difficult. Yes, but it's a benefit at the end. <laughs> yeah. So in the in, in what do you think about that, Anna? Good idea, bad idea. In my case, uh, be realistic. I prefer to a higher salary with a uh, favor benefits because in this country, the benefits are uh, secure, for example, uh, secure of life. I don't know if is the way correct life to say seguro de vida. Mm -hmm. life assurance or something like that uh, yes okay life assurance uh, these are big uh, benefits in, in our country uh, yes mm. uh, in a little case maybe they offer a bonus uh, 
for the well, reason sure. I prefer. Insurance. I prefer. Means el seguro. Yes. Insurance. Insurance. Mm -hmm. Okay. For the reason. Yes. I prefer. In my case, I agree with you. Uh, higher salary, lower benefits, because when you get fired, <laughs> uh, the salary is the beginning to start to calculate your, no sé, liquidation, liquidation. No, I don't know. Yeah, this one. I don't know. <laughs> but I know. Teacher, know help that. us, please. Teacher. He's not here. <laughs> yeah, sorry. What was the question? Uh, we are talking about when you get fired, uh, the company have to pay you that money, but I don't know how to say that money is. Um, indemnización. Indemnización. Yeah. Inde liquidación. Oh, liquidation. Um... I don't know. <laughs> um... Last payment. So compensation. 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 Okay. Maybe yeah. last compensation. Yeah, compensation. Mm -hmm. So for that reason, for me, it's better to uh, to get a higher salary because it's just the base to start. To... Hello. Hello, teacher. What happened? I'm I'm alone. Okay. I think that the other uh, partners, uh, they are listener. Ninguno de ellos está aquí presente. Nobody, no. Oh my goodness. I'm like a listener, but I can hear you. Sorry. Oh. I I'm a listener, but I can't hear you. But anybody's talking about it, anything. Okay, so Amanda, can you participate? Yeah, sure. Okay, perfect. All right, so you can go ahead and talk to to Amanda, Jorge. Okay, thanks. All right. Maybe you can refresh me about what is the topic. Uh, we work. Uh, we have to work in two questions that uh the teacher sends in the in the chat the group. Oh, yes, in the WhatsApp. Oh, is that about the, uh, about organization and more benefits about? About lower salary, right? Yeah. Okay. And what do you think about? Well, in the first question. Uh, the first question is, how do you motivate employees to engage in value-adding activities that benefit the organization? No, yes. For me, uh, I don't know. It's, 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 it's very difficult if you can motivate that people but uh, you can talk with the people with the with, you can talk with the employees and to motivate and convince them to work to achieve the company's objectives and for me the people is very important their their employees is very important and their activities is very important too and yeah. I think that if uh, they knows that uh, they very important and their activities is very important for the uh, achieve for the objective to company. Um, I think that the employees they be uh, motivated. You do you think that is a, a like an impossible or very difficult? Yes, it's difficult for the. I don't know if you. Uh, do you need uh, knows the each person and what is the different uh, motivation for for them? But uh, I know that is difficult. But you can try to motivate for the the employees. Okay, I get it. I got you. Well, I don't know. I'm working on a nonprofit organization and there is a lot of motivation, but it's not just for the money. It's for example, like a mental health assistance. I think that is the greatest thing that I have ever seen. 
because uh, they have like a program named uh, with a corporation named Conterra. And there is like an association, a, a kind of uh, mental or health security, secure. Ok. El otro examen es para el, el que está lleno no estudia. All right. So, um, would you like to share your ideas? So, the first question is, how do you motivate employees to engage in high in value adding activities that benefit the organization? How do you do that? What is your mm -hmm. idea? What are what are your ideas? How do you do that? Maybe increase the salary once in the year, and yeah, that depends obviously um results from some survey or evaluation for them. Okay. Sure. Mm -hmm. What else? Uh, teacher in my team, mm -hmm. uh, uh, told us uh, the company they have the strategies. Uh, in her opinion, they prefer more salary and lower benefits. Uh, they okay. have hold on, hold on. Before we go on to that question. We're discussing the first question, just the first one. So how do you motivate employees to engage in? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. The first the first question. Right now we'll we'll just do the oh, okay. yeah. only first. Yeah, only the first one. Okay. Any other ideas on how you can you can make the employees engage? Mm -hmm. For me, teacher, uh, to create an inclusive environment, make a sure our employee feel valued and heard, mm -hmm. promote uh, diverse, the diversity and quality in all activity. Promote, did you say? Promote. Diversity. 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 Diversity and equality in all activities. Okay. Yeah, sure. Okay, very good. Any other ideas on how you can do that? And the first question, teacher, uh, we talk about in our group that is important also that is is important that the salary, the benefit, the bonus, the bonus, uh, but it's important that that you have a a good leadership or a good communication on your team because it's the way that you you can you can add in value in in your activities. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good, 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 good. Any ide other ideas? For me, teacher, you can um, 
motivate your employees when you make them feel important for the company and mm -hmm. that their activities is very important for the achieve that different objectives for the company that people need needs feel important right. and it, for me is the the most important motivation for the employees no money no benefits for me okay yeah good 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 um good reasonings okay very good yeah and, and i agree i think um a feeling important is an important part of being motivated right if you feel that you actually matter in the company mm -hmm. good good job all right let's go on to the next question what do you think <laughs> do you think employees are more motivated by higher salaries and fewer benefits or lower salaries and more benefits what do you think is more motivating Receiving high salary. Sorry? I think uh, the employee need residing high salary. Okay. So high salary but low benefits. Uh yeah. Okay. All right. Because why uh, more so? yeah. Because of uh, benefits and 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 in years, uh, uh, recortan, recortan el, los beneficios. What do you say? Recortan los beneficios. Um, the reduce the benefits. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Ajá. Yeah, well, the, no, not the, completely. The, 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 love the benefit. Sorry, sorry, husband. Love the benefit. Uh, mm. no, not no. No. Um. Request. We could say. Put. We could say reduce. Yeah, we could say reduce. But a salary, no. Only oh, you mean that they don't, they cannot reduce the salary? Is, is that what you're saying? That they, they cannot reduce the salary? Yes, I think. Mm. Okay. Okay. All right. Good. Excellent. Good job. Thank you. Okay. Anybody else? Anybody want, else want to give their opinion? What do you think is, is more motivating? Higher salary, lower benefits, or higher benefits, lower salary? I agree with Mauricio, because in our country, the benefits are bad. And for this reason, I believe that it's a better idea, a higher salary and low benefits. Okay. So what if the benefits were good, though? Because that, that's what we're talking about. So if we have good benefits. Yes, but in, in our country, maybe don't have, for example, is a lower the quantity of company, maybe have bonus, for example, mm -hmm. uh, only maybe give a, a back with a food, but a little uh, thing or maybe give a, a life assurance or um, insurance, life insurance. Insurance, yes. Uh, or one uh, is excursion maybe a year. Um, for this reason, a, I think that- A trip. The, yes, uh -huh. a trip. Yeah. For this reason, I believe that the benefit in our country are not good mm. okay okay all right maybe Any... the benefit is the is the pen of the position here because i agree with anna because there 
the majority people in the company, the benefit is poor benefit that the company they give them. But if you are a is if you are a manager or something like that, you have more benefit mm -hmm. than than the rest of the people, or or you 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 have extra bonus or insurance, good insurance. But mm -hmm. the the operative people is not the reality in our country. The workers. This is the reason. Yes, this is the reason that maybe the people prefer that high salary mm -hmm. than benefit because the benefit is poor benefit that we receive in the company. Okay. Okay. Fair enough. All right. Please tell me if you are able to see my screen. You see my screen? Yes. Yeah. Yes, it is. Yes. yes. Wonderful. Okay. So here's that we have a conversation between Yoko and Steve. And I would like you guys to listen and repeat. Okay. Here we go. So what is what do you think is the best way? What do you think is the what best do you think way? Is the best way? Everybody, what do you think is the best way? What do what you do think you is think the best, best way? way? What do you think is the best way? To motivate an employee. To motivate, to motivate, an, employee. Employee. To motivate an employee. To motivate an employee. Creating a workplace. Creating a workplace. Work Where the employee is free. Where the employee is free. Is free. Is free. To make suggestions. To make suggestions. How do you do this? How do you do this? Motivating employees. Motivating employees. Is difficult. It's difficult. It's difficult. It's difficult. If they believe they will make if they, if they believe, believe they will make, make if they um, believe they will make a mistake a mistake 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 mistake, mistake. mistake. so we avoid rules so we so avoid, we avoid rules. rules we avoid rules there are some rules to prevent chaos there, there are some, some rules, rules, some rules, 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 rules to prevent chaos. 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 But our main motto, but but our our motto, main motto, motto is having no rules. Is having no rules. Having no rules. Having no rules. Then employees. Then, then employees. Then employees Will feel free to innovate. Will feel free to innovate. And propose changes. And propose changes. What are some of the benefits? That you use to keep. That you, you, used to keep, keep, you used to keep. Your in work, your workers motivated. Your, your workers, workers motivated. 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 Mm -hmm. Overtime is not allowed. Overtime, Overtime is not allowed. allowed. Wearing a uniform. Where Where is, you know, you know, is not a required thing. Is not a required, a required thing. thing. In our company. In our, our company. 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 And the whole company. And the, the whole, whole company. 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 
goes on a paid overseas goes on a paid overseas, overseas. vacation every five years all right very good okay bravo all right so what i want you guys to do right now is write in the chat not not saying out loud write in the chat vocabulary that you're not sure about so you vocabulary not you don't know the meaning okay so write in the chat. Anything else? Anything else? Okay. Um, all right, so let's start then. Creating comes from create, to create, to design, to make, okay? Avoid means that we try not to do something. We, we try at the most that we can to eliminate something. Okay, so we we don't we try not to do it. Then we have chaos. Um, chaos very similar to Spanish. Um, so like 
uh, disaster. Okay. Um, Modo um, is like a, um, it's like a saying, or it's a saying that you live by. It's, it's, it's something that you try to follow, like an idea that you try to follow. Um, how, how would you say that in Spanish, modo? Lema. Yes, correct. Right. Um, propose. Um, so to propose a change to to give an idea to like, yeah, like to make a proposal, right? So this is what um, a suggestion that you make. Okay. To keep your workers motivated, keep is to maintain. In this case, it's to maintain your workers motivated. Over time is like extra time that you work. So if you're only supposed to work eight hours a day, to give an example, and you work nine hours, that's overtime. Okay, and then we have whole. It means the complete, the entire company. Okay, so the complete company, not just a section, but completely. Paid, it means it's a past, paid is past participle of pay. So pay is to, to give the money, right? So paid yeah. means that you, that they gave, that the, the company gives the money, they, the, that the employers don't have to pay anything, okay? Overseas, overseas means um, across the oceans. Like so, like uh, for example, overseas would be on the other, so not in the same continent, but um, a, in a different continent that you have to cross the ocean. Okay. Do we understand the vocabulary? Teacher, teacher, mm -hmm. teacher for overseas, there is not like an, a concept, like with a cross ship and you go on the cross ship on board. It... Or it's just to across the, the sea. So I didn't understand the question. Can you repeat the question? There is like a concept overseas. When do you have a cross chief and you go on board and you cross the the sea literally, or this just across the sea? It, it means in a in different another country. Yeah, it means in a different country, uh, usually a very far away country that you have to go to the other side of the ocean. Oh, okay. It's just, a, and it can be like on a flight, for example. Mm -hmm. okay. Yes. Most okay. of the time it's in a flight. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. So for example, okay. So if you are in El Salvador, eh, overseas would not be going to Mexico, for example, because Mexico, you're in the same continent. Yeah, the same continent. Yeah. 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 Even if you yeah, go. Yeah, there's like Europe or. Right. Yeah, exactly. You would have to be going to Europe or to Japan, for example, um, okay. where you have to literally cross the ocean. Thank you, teacher. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. Okay. Any other? Okay. 
which is, it has like a similar concept to, um, a, to abroad, but abroad can be just simply another country, right? So uh, I, for example, I'm, I'm going to a vacation abroad means that I'm going to vaca vacation to another country, but it could be like the, the neighboring country. Like if I'm on El Salvador, I can be going to Guatemala and that would be over, it, it would be abroad. But overseas, I literally have to go to another continent. Anything Okay. All right. So uh, all of this vocabulary is clear for you, right? Yes. Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay, perfect. All right. What about uh, the pronunciation? You can write in the chat if there's any questions about pronunciation. Is that it? because I'm trying to figure out. Oh, that's Mm -hmm. That's it.
Then it. Okay. All right. So. Okay, so first word, creating. Creating. Everybody, creating. 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 Suggestions. Suggestions. Suggestion. Suggestion. Suggestions. Suggestions. Suggestion. Mm -hmm. Good. Um, motivating. 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 Difficult. 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 Innovative. innovative. Sorry, 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 sorry. Innovate. Sorry, innovate. 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 Mm -hmm. Propose. 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 <laughs> Benefits. 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 Allowed. 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 Required. 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 Um, and that's it. Okay. Any questions? Not teacher all clear. No? Okay. All right. So what I'm going to ask you guys to do is I want you to um, re I want you to practice this um, conversation with uh, a partner. Okay. I'm going to be sending you through the WhatsApp, the 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 conversation so you can easily refer to it and practice it. So one time you can be Yoko and the other time you can be Steve. Okay? Sounds good? Sounds good. Thank you. Okay. Good. So let me put you guys into breakout rooms. Okay, if anybody ends up being in a group where you do not have um, at least a partner, then let me know, okay? Where you go?
Okay. Um, I begin. What do you think is the best way to motivate an employee? Reading our place where the employees is free to make suggestions. How do you do this? Motivating employees is difficult if they believe uh, they will make a mistake, so we avoid problems. There are some rules to prevent a child's bad or main motto. It having to rules, the employees will feel free to innovate and propose change. What are some of the benefits that you use to keep your co-workers motivated? Over time, it's not allowing. Wearing a uniform is not a requiring the in our company and the world company. You can. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, what do you think is the best way to motivate an employee? Creating a workplace where the employees is free to make suggestions. How do you do this? Motivate employees is difficult if they believe they will make a mistake. So we have a rules. There are some rules to prevent chaos, but our main motto is having no rules. Then employees will feel free to innovate and propose changes. What are some of benefit, the benefits that you use to keep your worker motivated? Over time is not allowed. Wearing a uniform is not a required thing in our company. And the whole company goes on a pay overseas vacation every five years. Okay. Okay. Do you want practice once? Once. One more time. Yes. <laughs> okay. Okay, Joko again. Yes. What do you think is the best way to motivate an employee? Creating a workplace where the employee is free to make suggestions. How do you do this? Motivating employees is difficult if they believe they will make a mistake. So we avoid fuels. There are some fuels to prevent chaos, but our main motto is having no rules uh, then employees will feel free to innovate and propose changes what are some what are some of the benefits that you use to keep your workers motivated over time is not all allowed wearing a uniform is not a required thing in our company and the whole company goes on a pay overseas vacation every five years. Okay, okay now me, Joko. Joko, okay. Yes, what do you think is the... Okay. Yeah, it's finished. You do you have any questions? No questions.
Okay. All right, perfect. Um, all right, so let's discuss some questions about this. Proposed. About this um, conversation. So do you think external incentives such as money, extra benefits, are better to keep employees motivated? What do you guys think about this? Do you think external? Yeah, good idea. Yeah? Yeah. So it's better to, um, to use external incentives to keep the, the employees motivated? Or do you think it's better to use internal uh, in incentives? External or internal, what do you think is better? Better internal. What do you guys think? External or internal? What do you think is better? Which is an example of uh, internal incentives? Internal incentives? Um, for example, I, I don't remember right now who mentioned it, but um, for example, trying to um, let the employee understand that they are a they are an asset to the company, right? So they make them feeling important. So there is there are not just extra money, right? <laughs> Well, well, those are external, right? Brilliant. That that would be external. So internal is actually making it so motivating them from the inside. Teacher indicates that company uh, who select, for example, uh, employees of a month is internal. Sorry, can you repeat that again? When the company select uh, employees uh, of month, el empleado del mes? Oh, yeah. Yeah, so a recognition. Yeah, exactly. Um, yeah, yeah, exactly. That would be like, a, yeah, that would be like an internal. Mm-hmm. Yeah. All right, so what do you guys think? It's complicated question. I think that is a balance. You need a balance. You need to motivate and you need to make money also. <laughs> okay. You need both things. Is I think that you it's a balance in your company that you will do if you are motivated and, and if you are not motivated and you receive like extra benefits or extra monies mm -hmm. you are better you are better your job and you keep that to the employees more motivated mm -hmm. i think that both is you need both you need both <laughs> okay so you think it's important for both Yes, it's in my opinion, but if I decide one, I think that all people say money, yeah, because mm. it's, the economical situation is is not good. But if I if if I have to choose one, but I think that is a balance. If you are uh, employees motivated, mm -hmm. and you and you have the the that they receive incentives or or money or extra benefit is better they are they are always motivated for for do the the job mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. okay all right 
Okay, what about the next question? What is your opinion about the following? Motivating employees is difficult if they believe that they are that they will make a mistake. Do you agree with this? That it's difficult to motivate someone if they think that they're gonna make a mistake? Yes, some people maybe have a, um, a fear that mm -hmm. give her or their opinion because he uh, overthink uh, how the other people think about this or mm -hmm. about their. Okay. Okay, so they're like um, self-conscious, right? Is that what you're trying to say? They're self-conscious? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Do you agree? Yes, teacher, I agree. We're done now. Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay, what do you think about the method implemented by managers, by the manager in the conversation? What do you think about the methodology implemented? Remember, so that remember, what is the methodology? What what which which methodology are they implementing? Free fuels. Hmm. Free fuels, maybe. Sorry, I didn't understand very well. But what was the what was the methodology? Maybe free some rules. Free rules, did you say? Yes. Yes. Kind of, yeah. Um yeah, so So avoid, basically they're avoiding rules, right? They're avoiding rules. Just have some rules to prevent chaos. Right, so, but the main, the main motto is no rules. Basically that's what, what it is. So what do you think about that? What do you think about that, that motto? Do you agree with that? Do you think that's a good methodology? Or do you think that's a horrible methodology? What is your opinion? Um, I believe the majority people needs rules mm -hmm. and just to keep the order so if if we don't have rules uh maybe the cows uh, will be take the control so it will be more difficult to to put in order all all things all opinions all all people at least mm -hmm. Okay. So that motto for me is not a good idea. Okay. Maybe in a different country, yes, because uh, when we're talking about the main set, is is different. Mm -hmm. So in in our country, I don't think so. That is a good idea. Okay. Okay. How do you pronounce this word? Chaos, 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 chaos. No, <laughs> kinda. Okay, listen. K chaos. 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 Chaos.
and then os. Chaos. Chaos. Okay. Okay. So K. Chaos. Basically, it's like this. Chaos. 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 Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Anything else? What do you guys think? So do you agree with Carlos? So not in, in our country, not the best idea? <laughs> yes, I agree with Carlos because it's cultural. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's cultural. Depend, you, it culture. Yes, it depends the culture. If, if, but in our country, you need to rule for, for do something. Mm -hmm. mm. Okay. Yeah, everybody agrees? Okay. All right. Good, good, good. Um, okay. I'm going to stop sharing there. All right. So um, what we're going to do right now is take our attendance for today's class. Um, just a second. Okay. So, Ana Lorena Lovato. Present teacher. Thank you. Um, Carlos Alberto Dominguez. Present teacher. <laughs> Thank you. Um, Carlos Ernesto Hernández Cepeda. Present. Good, thank you. Um, Carlos Mauricio Menjibar, caballero. Present. Thank you. Edwin Antonio Quintero Somaña. Present, teacher. Thank you. Eh, Emerson Ulises Monroy. Present, Miss. Excellent, thank you. Um, Aulices Torres Torres. Present. Thank you. Um, Iliana Rebeca Carpio. Iliana Rebeca. Eh, Jorge Antonio Sánchez. Present, teacher. Thank you. Uh, Jose Bernardo López. Present, miss. Thank you. Uh, can, can we turn on the camera? Yes, yeah, sorry. Ah, I forgot. Wonderful. Thank you. Okay. Um, Jose Carlos Argueta. Jose Carlos Argueta. Um, Jose Salvador Bernal. I'm here, teacher. Okay, very good. Thank you. Um, Josman Atilio Serrano. Present. Thank you. Juan Carlos Herrera Delgado. Present, Miss. Thank you. Uh, Kevin Alfredo Lucero Menendez. Present. Wonderful. Perfect. There you go. Okay. Uh, Mauricio Antonio Velasquez. 
Present teacher. Thank you. Uh, Mayra Cecilia Peña. Mayra. Nelson Alberto Peraza Mejia. Present teacher. Thank you. Um, Osman Enrique Hernández. Osman. Rafael Alexander Serna Díaz. Present. Thank you. Ricardo Ernesto Pérez Acosta. Present teacher. Thank you. Uh, Sandra Abigail Boniacano. Present. Okay, wonderful. Um, Sandra? Okay. Uh, Sefrido Ernesto Gomez. Present. Thank you. Wendy Maricela Ramirez. Present teacher. Thank you. Um, Mina Elizabeth Alvarenga Rivas. Present. Thank you. Irma Evelyn Rodríguez Torres. Irma Evelyn. She's sick. Ah, okay. Uh, Amanda Leonela Zamora Miranda. Yes, yeah, present. Thank you. And Eduardo Antonio Magaña Monterrosa. Okay, so Ricardo, se encuentra Ricardo todavía, okay. Ricardo? I'm here. Perfect. Mm -hmm. So today you have the one-on-one -on -one session, so you can stay behind. Everybody else, um, I will see you guys tomorrow, okay? So take care and have a wonderful evening. Okay, bye-bye. Bye, Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Everybody, good night. Good night. Good night. Good night, teacher. Good night. Hello, Ricardo. Hi, teacher. Okay, so how can I help you? Do you have any questions so far? Any problems with the platform? Uh, for now, I I think I don't have any questions, actually. Uh, well, one, actually one, uh, I I want to tell you that the last Friday I was not in a class because I was sick. I'm still sick. I was sick. I, I don't know if you hear my voice. I'm I'm a little uh, strange, uh, weird. I don't know how to say it. But I was sick. Uh, I had a, a, a um, I went to the 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 Seguro Social and take a a uh, incapacidad, una incapacidad, entonces... Uh, a sick leave. How? Sick leave. Sick leave. Yes. So I have a sick leave for that day, and I, and I don't know if I have to send it to you, or uh, if that doesn't... Um. So you can... Um... It, 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 it won't be to, to me because I can, like, um, I only take care of the academic part. Um, the administrative oh, okay. part, I don't take care of that. So um, if you want, you what you can do is send it to um, the other people, the, the administrators of the group. Do you, do you see in that in the WhatsApp group, there's uh, some administrators? Mm, yeah, like Clarice Gaviria, maybe. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So you can you can send it there, um, and you know, now they don't have they don't have the authority either to give you the permission, but what they can do is send like that report to Insaforp, and they will decide. Oh, okay, you know, they will see that that you that you had a sick leave that day and and most likely they will be able to give you that um or that justification but all we do is is pass on the report okay okay mm -hmm. okay no mm -hmm. problem um i think that's all that i wanted to ask you okay uh, all right so everything else is 
is okay. Any questions? Mm, no, for now, no. No, everything is okay. Yeah. Okay, perfect. So um, the platform, you're, you're up to date with, with the exercises? In the platform? I I did finish uh um unit three, right? That's mm -hmm. what we are we were doing. Yeah. And I only have left the unit four and the midterm. Yeah. Okay. So it's with the solid midterm. Good, yeah, the midterm. Yeah. So the midterm covers uh unit section three and four, unit three and four. Yeah. So what you can do is already start with the the, the mid sorry, the final exam. The yeah the final exam because we we already covered unit three so you can already oh, okay. start with that because remember you have to have everything finished by Friday so you don't want to be like uh rushing everything okay, okay okay all right understood okay good anything else I can help you with Ricardo mm, I don't think so thanks no? okay all right well in that case I will see you tomorrow. Okay, bye. Okay, Good night. all right. Good night.